When Adam Jerome Ezekiel Thielen announced this morning that the Vikings had restructured his deal, we were thinking, okay, it's going to be a classic restructure. They're just going to move some money around. But aha, it is not. It is actually legitimately a pay raise uh, for Adam Thielen, which is fantastic as he heads into uh, the golden years of his career. So this is from the Star Tribune. Receiver Adam Thielen agreed to restructure his contract with the Vikings, buying the team some needed salary cap relief and giving the veteran receiver additional security through guaranteed money. Thielen's agency announced the deal on Friday. The move is expected to create around 5 to $6 million in cap space with accounting measures that spread charges over the life of the contract that now includes a void year and 2025, according to a league source. So when you're restructuring a contract, contract if it's a classic restructure where it's the base salary converted into a rooster bonus and then spreading uh, those cap hits out you don't need a uh, player uh, you don't need a player to sign off on that but if you're adding void years you basically you need to have a new deal that's what happened with Kirk Cousins and that's what's happening with Adam Thielen full terms of the restructure are not immediately available baloney but the agency, uh, blah, 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 announced that he'll get $18 million guaranteed. Half will be paid in a $9 million signing bonus. I guess you can't get rid of me. Kids got alligator blood. Thomason uh, expanded. Source says Adam Thielen, who's on the books for a non-guaranteed $12 million, uh, blah, blah, blah. Base salary 2022 to make guaranteed $14.4 million. Uh, in 2022, including a $9 million signing bonus to have $18 million total guaranteed in the remaining years of his contract. And Void Year was that in 2025. Da, 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 da. So what's amazing? is that Thielen, who turns 32 in August, he had no guaranteed money left on his deal. Yeah, his four-year, $64.2 million deal is out of guaranteed money. Yeah, like Most NFL contracts, even though it says three, four, five years on it, they're really generally one-year deals, typically two, where you get that signing bonus up front, the first year is guaranteed, second year can be injury guaranteed or guaranteed on the third day of the new league year, but for all intents and purposes, not really. Uh, so even though Thielen... It was only in year two of his extension. He was out of guaranteed money. But now he gets $18 million guaranteed with a $9 million signing bonus up front. And his base salary is raised from $12 million to 14.4. And with the void year, the Vikings actually save 5 to $6 million in 2022 salary cap space. If you needed any more proof that hashtag cap is a myth, this is it. And the new contract will make Thielen about the 15th highest paid receiver in the league, which I think does stand up. And last year with the ankle injury was a bit of a fluke. But I think if he got a full healthy season, him and Kirk Cousins do have uh, a nice chemistry in the red zone. Also, uh, Cousins was on Thielen's podcast. Uh, and there were some good times. Like they talk about the whole beef in you know, the first year, uh, week 17 against the Bears when Kirk was going like this. I think they do have a good rapport. I think they have a good professional relationship. And with Justin Friggin Jefferson going to get all the targets, uh, there's going to be so much one-on-one -on -one, uh, coverage for Adam Thielen. So he'll be able to attack the middle of the field. He'll be able to attack the red zone. So I think that Thielen and Kevin O'Connell's new offense, second year working with Keenan McCardell, I think that Thielen could have a little nice, nice renaissance. Now, I, I still believe in KJ Osborne. I think he'll have a fantastic year of three. ISM is going to do great things, too. Maybe they'll even add a rookie wide receiver in the draft, preferably speed, because speed kills. And you got to love it, man. But the Vikings and Kevin O'Connell and Kirk Cousins, they want to throw the ball. If they can get some protection, they're going to be able to throw the ball because the Vikings receivers, they ain't a problem. Absolutely not. And also, I love... Again, you only restructure guys or you only give guaranteed money to guys that are going to be sticking around. So whether Thielen's going to be around two, three, four years, I love it. Uh, I love it. He needs to retire in purple. It would be so weird if he went anywhere else because anywhere else besides Minnesota, he's just a guy. But here, he is our Paul Bunyan. He is the pride of Detroit Lakes, Mankato State University Community College. Nailed it. Screw the Mavericks. Went out of state forever. Anyways, uh, anyways, that's it. Uh, that's the details of Adam Thielen's extension. Uh, well, not really extension. Restructure, whatever you want to call it. It's not a classic restructure. Let us know your thoughts in the comment section below. Subscribe for daily Viking stakes. Want to support the work? Venmo. It's Friday. Pay that man his money, just like they did with Thielen, baby. But until next time, Skull Production Value.